Hello everyone, Coolbones here with another video, well, a video on Fall of the Titanic. A Titanic game, but it's not a good one. I have made a video on this in the past, but here we are, back at it. I've still got that video. I took it down from YouTube though. So let's see if this one's better. I'm going to do ex escape mode because I actually know how to do it now. Um, and also, I did um, explore mode in my last one, which wasn't that good. Alright, here we are. We're on the deck of Titanic. I can already see a problem. That is not the correct door. There was no window up there. I believe there wasn't. Correct me if I'm wrong. The lifeboats are completely wrong. The davits are wrong. I'm sorry, shouldn't be nit nitpicking, but here she is. It's a good rep like representation of her, but not the best. Like, I'm looking forward to, um, Fall of Titanic. They don't even have the right lights up here. Because, um, on the Titanic, the lights towards the bridge were, had covers so they wouldn't shine towards the bridge. Because the bridge wasn't lit because of the visibility. They couldn't see in the dark. Whoops, I just knocked the microphone. Sorry. I do like this um new animation for the um sinking or the collision. And there's a dude down there. I wish he was able to finish this game. You cannot you cannot buy it anymore. So I like this game but it's not the best. So, we're going to now wake up third class cabin. Salmon, you better not make any noise. That's my cat, sorry. I know, weird name. Oh well. So, without any more snoring, let's get into the escape. Alright, I don't have control. Come on. It's so slow. Ah, now there's there should be a bed there. Oh, it's there. Alright, now what? I was looking that way, but now I'm looking that way. And you can knock the table around. Alright. Flashlight. I know how to do this, I've done one playthrough. You'll go in here. You'll get that. Watch out, I just clipped through that. Look. Heh. <laughs> oh well. And look, my pickaxe is a vampire. Is my pickaxe the only thing that has a shadow? I don't even have a shadow, I don't think. Oh well. In this part you don't have to move fast. There should be a hole here, if that's where these are. There should be a hole there that goes down to um, one of the boiler rooms. Or the engine room, I'm not sure. Wrong way. This way, to the purse's cabin. I don't think he was this low. No, he would have been in Scotland Road, not down here. That and go into the nothingness of above. Now, there's a hint over here. Some doors might collapse when subject to too much flooding in a short time. This part always got me when I was younger. I always thought, what door's gonna collapse? And I did this. And I. But you gotta run up this hallway towards the second grand staircase, the after grand staircase. 
until it collapses and you can run through. Then, for some reason, the lower part of the grand staircase does not have that. Oh well, we need to go down Scotland Road now. Some large discharge of air that's got a door open. I didn't notice that before. That's gonna break. Let's go that on. Discharge and now anybody who's down in third class dining rooms are a little bit screwed. Like honestly. Now you gotta go. Uh gotta get closed in. We're safe. Why isn't this one shutting? They normally all shut at once. Now we need a water flow. In around second class. This way. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, something's breaking. Go go down. There's me. A chair is in the floor. We're on D deck. There should be um some beautiful double portholes behind them windows. Now we're in the grand staircase. Apparently, like they've stacked chairs or did they roll down there. Which go go over here into this. Now, do they have the other door? The port side, I believe. They open the D deck door. I see myself in the face with the door. Another loading screen. Oh, shortly I'm um, followed by not responding, then it's responding. Go, go. Aft now. To the aft grand staircase again. You can actually like make it do that fast enough, I found out. But I can never get to be fast enough again. Now, we have to move a piano by ourselves. Like, look. It's like skating on ice. And that you don't even have to push it near the door. And you can go around this side, so it takes you longer. Go in here, in here. Just a random person's cabin. Get the key. Walk out. And go down here. I like this game, but you could use it. Even though the person who made it isn't really good anymore. Now we're on loading. And here we are. Now we gotta go to first class reading and writing room. There's boat deck just up there. Now this isn't real time syncing. I do want to do the real time syncing um, thing. That isn't. We're not even in the first class the seconds. But whatever. Now we go load. Load in the boat deck. That is a horrible rendering of the white star flag with SS Titanic on it. Apparently not in the lifeboat's being used, but. Oh well. We don't even have that much time apparently because the bridge is already gone. And we're honking the horn. The horn's still going. I don't think they would be doing that. <sighs> it seems to be on the open one. Horn. Oh, I don't like that. The stern's wrong. Look at that. Stern's wrong. All up deck feels a little bit too open, but apparently we gotta jump. Uh, oh, we're done. Fall of the Titanic. We don't even have propellers. 
how did we even get out here? We got towed out here and then hit an iceberg. Did we? I don't know. Apparently this rowboat could row without like rowing. Thanks for playing. It's been good, but there's this needs some work to it. Like look at that light. And the lights aren't even on the portholes. And that porthole goes too far on um sea deck. Goes way too far towards the end of the wall. Nobody's gonna be looking through that. But in memory of all the Titan It's a good game, but it needs some work. Like it really needs some work. But she is getting lower in the water, but at this point the first funnel would have fell fallen over. snapping oh and I can't move my mouse all right I'll get back to you when I fix the mouse problem. 